Today, August 18th, celebrate the feast day of St. Helena of Constantinople. Born in Bithynia, the daughter of a humble innkeeper, Helena rose above her humble beginnings. After marrying the Roman general, Constantius I Chlorus. Following the birth of their son, Constantine, Helena's husband, was elevated to junior emperor and proclaimed Caesar. He divorced Helena in order to further his political ambitions by marrying a woman of noble rank. Years later, in 312, when his son Constantine became emperor, he showed his mother great tolerance and respect, granting her the imperial title Augusta. By this time, Helena converted to Christianity when she was 63 years old. And through her witness, the emperor made faith in Christ the official religion of the Roman Empire. With the authority of her son, St. Helena went to Palestine in search of the sacred sites about the year 324. And with the ardent desire of discovering the cross on which our blessed Redeemer suffered. During excavation, three crosses were found buried in the earth, one for each thief crucified beside Jesus and the true cross upon which he gave his life for the world. Gazing upon the crosses, Helena was unsure of which might be the wood of salvation. A woman from Jerusalem who was near certain death from a disease she had contracted was brought to Golgotha and made to touch each of the crosses. As soon as she approached the cross of our Lord, she was cured. St. Helena continued to journey to the holy places, connected with the earthly life of the Saviour, building more than 80 churches. Shortly after, Helena herself returned to Rome, where she expired in 330 at the age of 80. St. Helena of Constantinople, pray for us.